Yeah, roll it, yeah. Hello, Internet. Hello, In Internet. Uh, my name is Yves. Um, and behind the camera here is Jean Jean. And uh, we are here to show you a bit what it is to be in the life of a programmer, of a developer, of a game dev. So this is the, both the working and the lounge place. So, uh, <laughs> help the viewers out here, which one's which? Because uh, uh, they look similar to the untrained eye, don't they? It, it does, that's why you need to train your eye. This is very, very simple, and yet it is functional. Okay. That is why it is the working couch. But, do you notice that here, it is still simple, but you have two pillows oh, nice. for lounging and, and resting. And yes, this? This, oh, this is nothing, this is just, you know, some kind of clever fantasy book, we, we read some, uh, some stuff we, like we that. We are bookworms, yeah. aren't we? We are bookworms. Well, I think um, some amount of the teamwork comes from the fact that, I mean, we don't have a hierarchy. There's, I mean, yeah. we, there are things that I'm better at than Eve, and Eve has skills, um, so, you know, it, it I do. Out. I do agree that, okay. that is great that there is no hierarchy or uh, competition between us. No. No. Like, this is always something that is very, um, you know, stressful for me, because when I go there and I, and I say, okay, this is my vision, and you, with your hands, have to, to code it. Yeah. yeah, and I come with all these artistic ideas and, uh, and values and, and what I want to say and to express and all this suffering is always hard. I feel like I am imposing this on someone and it's really, really hard to find someone like you who doesn't care about sure. being told everything and just does it. And that is really nice. Yeah, uh, I mean, and I mean on, on, on the other hand here from yes. a technical point of view, I mean I don't think that for, for me you've ever given me anything too taxing. You know, I would say that most of the things you asked for have been you know, simple, like, in, in, a, in, a, in a positive sense, they've been childish, idiotic, almost, some of the ideas you come up with, and it makes, it makes my job very easy, uh, because, yeah, you're not taxing me, really, in any special sense. Well, I mean, uh... Yeah, I mean, I... We, I, we, we are not in this for the money. No. I mean, that's... No, you're, you don't need it, so no. you're not in it for yes. the money. Um, I... And I expect, I mean, I really expect big things from this game. Um, I I mean, I've put, I've put a down payment on a Ferrari, so yeah. I'm relying, you know, on, on the sure fact. I mean, who, when has a video game not made someone a lot of money? I mean, yeah. no one... I think this is what's so great, is I don't think anyone has ever just sat down before, especially two guys, yeah. have never just sat down and gone, let's make a video game. I think yeah. there should be more of that, yes. so, but there's not, so we really have a monopoly on this market at the moment, so I, I, I personally don't, don't see how this could fail mm. at all. No, there is, we're the only one, the only ones doing what we do. I wouldn't describe us as saviours. Or messiahs, obviously. No, not quite. But but we we are we, we are a glass of water in hell. I I think this is very true. Yeah, yes. I, I, I glass. That of is water. what we are. Yes, we are a glass of water in hell. Yes. Uh, vous êtes uh, développeur de jeux vidéo. Uh, Est-ce qu'on pourrait savoir uh, sur quoi vous travaillez? Uh, quel uh, genre de, je sais pas, j'y connais rien, de processeur vous utilisez pour uh, pour faire un peu tout, tout ça là, tout votre business? Mm. I'm guessing that you you've never made a game before. Is that is that correct? <laughs> ouais ouais c'est vrai ouais vous, vous m'avez eu c'est vrai j'ai jamais fait ça. Yeah, no, so I can tell from so I actually have a uh, a MacBook. So it's like a computer, uh, but it's much it, it's better. REMS, speed cycle, temperature, detergent type and all this, but like, you know. In terms of the development process, the way it normally works is that Eve will um, give me 
an idea. He'll say, um, Jean, can you, I don't know, can you make it so that this man flies? And I say, yeah, sure. Could most other programmers do it? No. But can I? Yeah. I'm very talented. Really. Yeah. Waouh, ça a l'air super impressionnant dit comme ça, donc euh, vous diriez que c'est genre un technological breakthrough ou euh, c'est ce que vous êtes en train de faire ou vous utilisez des technologies déjà, déjà connues qu'est-ce que c'est votre but quand vous yeah. développez ce jeu so that's a, so, so in terms of technological breakthrough I've, I'm using a new development suite for this so I found out that actually like if you ask any programmer what they use they'll be like oh I use Vim, Emacs Linux, KDE, 42-bit thing. So, um, most of the game, um, in terms of programming languages, I've made my own for this, and it has many advantages. It can do, you know, the, uh, well, you'll see some gameplay in a bit, and like the, 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 the 3D distance rendering, the cell shading, um, some of the more like isotropic filters. We've got like a 4K scaled up overlay distance uh, suite that's running. Um, all of this kind of stuff wouldn't normally be possible with your normal programming languages like Microsoft Excel or PowerPoint. And I really think that what we're doing here is... is it's as good as bread. Tout ça est vraiment très impressionnant, surtout au vu de, de votre très jeune âge. Et on aimerait savoir comment ça vous est venu cette, cette passion, en fait, pour, pour le jeu vidéo. Uh, so I guess when I was growing up, I realized quite quickly that other people, human beings, if you will, uh, could not hold my interest or attention. So while a lot of boys at school were talking about the sports they played and the drugs they'd done over the weekend, I found refuge in, in the digital world. Um, so here we can see the, uh, my, my setup here. Um, I've got, this is where I do some, some of the programming, um, and so we'll give you a, a tiny glimpse of the, the first level at the moment, um, which we've got. So, it's obviously still a work in progress, um, but I think, I think really the, the gameplay speaks for itself. I'm a man of few words, and I don't really like being in the camera, so... What I'm about to show you is, is really my soul, okay? Bad for the world to see. Um, so if I just uh, hack the, the mainframe eyed here to... I, I won't bore you with all the, um, the technical words, anyway. Right? Um, okay, so here we go. So this is, this is what we've got so far on the, on the first, first level. Um, so you can see there's... Here's the, the main character. Uh, it represents you, but also me, in a way. Um, and here we can see the movement. You can see that actually when he moves, this took a long time and not many other games do this, he actually rolls over like this, okay? Um, here we've got some water. We're going to work on adding a swimming level later on. Um, this is a wall here. You can see you can't go through the walls. It's very high uh, physics thing. And over here we have some flowers. Uh, and for, for the moment that's it. So there's this, but this is the second level I'm working on, which you can see here now. Um, which really is kind of a, uh, so it's, so the first level is all about birth. This second level here is about death. And... Merci beaucoup pour euh, cette incroyable plongée en exclusivité dans un jeu vidéo qui rencontrera beaucoup de succès, on en est sûr. Exactly. If you can't see something, it can't hurt you. That, that's yeah. literally the truth. Except love, maybe. But that's but. something else, you know. <laughs> so, Eve, um, I'm yes. sure a lot of our people will be interested, first of all, to know what your vision is with this game. Oh. Well, you see, uh, I've always thought that uh, if you don't do something that is artistically groundbreaking, groundbreaking there is no point of, uh, of trying to do it. So my vision was really to tackle some issues that have never been tackled in any video game, ever. Like, for instance, 
I don't know if Jean-Jean uh, has already shown you a bit of the gameplay, but there are lots of interesting stuff going on there. Like, like the representation of space and time. So our main ca character, as you might uh, see, he's, he's moving, but he's rolling. And since it's a top-down perspective, well, you cannot actually know where he's facing, what is up, what is down, what is left or right. It just always questions your perception of, of space and time, because he moves in time also. So I think these are sorts of really interesting physical, metaphysical and philosophical ideas that we've never seen in a game. And our goal is just to do... Like, I think this game, artistically speaking, with this sort of question, will be just as important as Interstellar, which is my favorite movie. Okay, so could you talk a bit... Uh, Jean uh, mentioned it earlier, Jean-Jean, sorry, um, that the, there is a lot of influence by Eastern and Western French philosophy uh, yes. in the game. Could you talk a little bit about why you did not choose to use, for example, Northern French philosophy? Well, I actually like. Uh, I don't think that uh, Jean Jean fully understood, but you know, this is just a cultural difference. Uh, I actually used uh, some uh, bit of uh, Northern philosophy. Uh, the one I left out was the Southern uh, philosophy. Uh, because uh, mostly of uh, the, the rules uh, regarding alcohol and pastis in a media representation, uh, we cannot. So it was very hard to implement something from the south, like Marseille, inside a, a video game that is supposed to be for, uh, for everyone. You, you can't make an omelette without breaking a few eggs, you know? Like we wanted to tackle an issue, some people didn't like it, I think that what, that's what makes great art. If people reacted, even if it was negative, that's because we did something good. So there is no way going on this any longer. We need to do new things. We always need to push the boundary. That's what we're about, you know? Okay. Pushing the boundaries. Ha. Huh. Um, none. Yeah, I, I mean, none, but also all of them. Yes, it really is like a dual thing, you know, it's yeah, one or the other. But don't restrict your imagination on one given concept. No. The whole spectrum, or nothing. Yeah, I mean, we're not... Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It has snails. It has to be snails. Okay, that's fair. I'm a vegan, so it means that all of my meat is ethically sourced from a butcher who uses no leather in his, his knife handles. Mm. Um, there's no, like, suede or velvet. No eggs. It is, it is hard because I have seen so many and there are, there are many that are really, really good. But probably, I think Maybe not in terms of what is the best movie of all time, yeah. because like, this is obviously the third installment of Matrix. I would have to say it's probably the, the Ninja Turtles, the first one. And mine would be Shrek's 3 through 5. Okay, for me, I know not many people are going to know this, and I'm sorry for them, but uh, it's a very, very famous French book, and uh, it's Martin à la plage. I, re I really love Martin à la plage. This, okay. uh, you know, this gets me. Uh, the, the, yeah. the, the, this vision of, uh, of childhood and of little girls uh, going uh, almost naked on the, on the beach is, uh, is, is, a, a, is a wonder. Oh, I, knew, I knew you were going to ask that. Yeah. Anyway. Um, and this is a trick question because, like, obviously, our favorite game is, is, is the games we the make. Games we make. Mean, why yes. would we make something, something that, that we don't like? like. Exactly. It's um... if we were for a plant, what would we need? Moi, je une belle plante. That yeah, I identify strongly with the cactus. Is the cactus a plant? Oh yeah, I think it is. Yeah, I. I I'd say I'm a cactus. Yeah, same as him. A cactus is good. Uh, you, you can... Yeah, for 
follow your dreams, have a passion, do it, don't give up, whatever, I don't care. Uh, yeah, uh, learn to know how to know when to give up. Oh, 